I love y'all a lot. <laughs> I really love you. Um, <laughs> I do not have a storage unit full of diversity and champion awards, um, but I'm 30-something in New York, so I'm going to need a storage unit for that one, probably. <laughs> um, I am very nervous, so my remarks are actually upside down, so I'm going to flip them. <laughs> I'll fumble and get an applause. Uh, I'm so honored to be here tonight. Um, I, the Year of the Girl, Nate, this is our third consecutive Year of the Girl. Um, it is my first award in almost a, over a decade of doing this work, uh, and I cannot think of an organization that I would rather receive it from. Um, <laughs> or honorees that I would rather receive it next to. Uh, Brett Parker, on his way out this evening, placed a cash bet that I would not cry. Um, or that I would cry. Um, and I, I bet him that I would not in two minutes. So somebody give me a sign when my two minutes are up because I got, <laughs> got some weeks. Um, <laughs> um, this has never been a, a job for me. And this has never been about me. It's always been a, an experience where I was able to be a vehicle for all of your experiences and your innovation and your ideas. Um, I have always sought to make connections with each of you, connections for each of you, and connect you to one another. Um, I was raised to believe that if you approach a problem with compassion and generosity, the solution will present itself. And I've been led astray only a handful of times in this pursuit. Uh, what I wanted to achieve in my career at the City Bar was to focus less on the numbers. I inherited our benchmarking research, and yes, I do enjoy walking into rooms and telling people what they need to know about them. But more importantly, I enjoy walking into rooms and helping them get to a solution, a collaborative solution through their leadership, through their associates, their clients, other partners and friends. Uh, and I think that's the power of our relationships. Uh, I couldn't have done this alone, and my thank yous would exceed, far exceed the two minutes that I've been allotted. So I have tried to distill it to all of the people that truly poured into my career. Uh, I would save the best for last, but I can't. Paula Edgar, you are unparalleled in your energy and in your impact and in your friendship and in your humor and you just made this job really easy. I have a TV now though. I just want to say, I've got a really big TV now. <laughs> and I've watched all the shows that Paula told me I needed to watch. <laughs> just a lot of TV watching. <laughs> uh, to my City Bar family, Brett Parker could not be here. Maria Salenti, my life changed when you walked into the Bar Association uh, Elizabeth Kachenda, you have been my companion and one of my best friends. Uh, to our presidents, to our amazing committee leadership, and all the mentors and friends that I found in our membership in the last 10 years. Uh, there are way too many to name, but Carla Prez, Rabia Kwasim, Courtney Laidlaw, Lloyd, uh, can't even remember Lloyd's name because I'm so nervous. <laughs> Uh, and all those students that walked into the, the city bar in the pursuit of a career in the legal profession. It's hard not to be an optimist when you are the future. It is so bright. It has been an honor to be part of your epic journeys. Uh, Nate St. Victor and Sheila Boston, thank you so much for saying yes to me. Uh, to everyone in the room, <laughs> there's a lot of you who believed me when I said with conviction, it will be a small commitment. It will just be a tiny, tiny offering 10 years ago when you joined the committee, when you joined the city bar, when you came alongside me. Uh, to my Cup family and my friends, so many of you are here tonight. If you haven't heard about Cup, you're about to. Uh, and I'm at, am I at two minutes because this is an important one? Yeah. Sophie. <laughs> so I'm going to get my call off music. Uh, <laughs> I do really love a lot of people in this room, but I love no one in this room or in this world more than Sophie. Sophie. <laughs> My niece, you embody everything our family has raised us to be, which is compassionate and generous and in pursuit of solutions. So thank you for spending tonight with me. And that was two minutes, so I got my money. <laughs> Uh, amassing this incredible network has been the most significant accomplishment of my career, and I'm so thankful for all of you. So many of you feel like my family, and I love you, and I've been lucky to work with you, and I hope you know I did all of this with all of my heart. So my call to action tonight is we do this work in difficult times, and it has not been easy, but as you think about your impact, as you think about your connections within your respective organizations, 
please put a little heart into it. Thank you so much.